praise God. And yes, so sorry for that interruption, you know, but the important part is that you heard the message and the teaching this evening that I had to offer. And that is what all that matters. As long as the message go through, that is all that matters and that is all that matters. Hallelujah. So I pray that you took everything into stride and you were able to actually learn something there and you were able to actually understand a few things and to actually um, uh, grow from the teaching that I just um, released this evening. It's imperative to know in, in summary and in conclusion that whenever you're going to consult or divinate, number one, the main thing is that you have already turned away from the Lord. So a judgment is against you. Number two, when you're going to divinate, when you go to a medium, you are, you are actually falling victim to spirits that prey on your thoughts and your perception. What you are thinking is what they now use to give you the word that you want. And nowhere is it actually involving God because when they use perception, like what Apostle Paul says that and he perceived it was someone, they're using Edo, which is the eye of the mind. Hallelujah. And we need to get into a generation where people seek God with the eye of God or the mind of God, which is to Ra. Hallelujah. So I pray that you're able to actually learn a few things from there. Hallelujah. And to actually grow so that you will not actually fall victim to most of these things and everything else. Hallelujah. And I, I'm very excited that I had to go to spend time with you uh, this evening like this. Right now, I am I'm still awake. I've got, I've got a list of people that I need to talk to. Hallelujah. I've got a list of people that I need to talk to here. Uh, that I'm going to be calling. I'm sure some of them are watching. So if you are watching now, right now, and you registered for uh, a private one-on-one, -on -one, I'm only doing these ones because of the lockdown, because of COVID. Hallelujah. So since people cannot travel, so since people cannot come, so since people cannot um, uh, physically sit in my office and to actually get an opportunity to have one-on-ones, private one-on-ones, there are certain people who actually would want to have one-on-ones with me, but unfortunately, they might not want to have them live on Facebook because I'm, I have most of mine on Facebook because I have nothing to hide most of the time. So these are the people who request for private one-on-ones. Hallelujah. And I'll, I'll try to accommodate them because of this COVID. Once this thing is over, then we revert back to the normal systems. We try, we're not trying to we have to try to actually just see how we can actually uh, accommodate everybody in the season and times. Hallelujah. Uh, and so there's no better time to actually seek the mind of God than now after this teaching. Because in we have learned and we have known ourselves in this ministry to our standard through our teaching that God is the one who we always speak with. And who is the one whom we consult? That is why we're always consulting the mind of God. We are, that's why we're constantly teaching that you must always, you must always, you must always, you must always seek the mind of God concerning anything and everything. Hallelujah. So the teaching was good. All that is left now is for me to call these people, whatever they are. I know, you know, you registered for a private one-on-one, -on -one, so... Uh, since I'll not be live on Facebook, I'll be live talking to you. So get yourself ready. Put your makeup. Put your wig. Hallelujah. And get ready. I'm calling you just now. You know yourselves. And it will be amazing. Hallelujah. Those that would want me. I think tomorrow I'm also. Um, tomorrow I'm going to do um, letters from heaven. Letters from heaven. So tomorrow we'll do letters from heaven. Uh, um in the afternoon, we do letters from heaven in the afternoon, so you can register for letters from heaven. And then we can do prophecy in the evening as we go, seeking the mind of God concerning our situation. No divination, no seeking dead spirits, 
but seeking the mind of God. Hallelujah. So this is beautiful. This is beautiful. So I'm going to be up for a while. It is, I don't know what time it is right now. It is uh, 10 minutes past 2 a.m. here in Africa. So I have up, up, up until 6 a.m. So I've got six up until 6 a.m. to be talking to people who registered for private one-on-ones, people who want to talk about personal issues that are really very personal or troubling issues. So I've got four hours to talk with those people. You can call the number. Messi is putting it on. You can call the number. Messi is putting the number on. You can call the number and register for a private one-on-one. -on -one. You can call and then say, I want to be on the list that Papa is talking to people right now for the private one-on-one. -on -one. Then you'll be able to put, I've got four hours to do that, so you make sure you do it within the time. Or you can um, ask Sister Wanda Johnson. She's watching uh, uh, on the private one-on-one. -on -one. And then they'll be able to assist you on how you'll be able to do that. So I've got four hours to do the one-on-ones after an amazing teaching that we have done. So don't, don't, for, don't, uh, let me tap, type in this comment. So don't be left, don't be left behind. Uh, somebody sent the messages. I sent you a message. Why didn't you reply? What was this? I don't know. It's a woman. So you send me a message where on Facebook. This page is 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 number one. This page is my social media accounts are managed by people. I sometimes post here and there. I post actually, but there are people who reply messages who make sure that the postings I do or the teachings that I t I teach, they post them during the week. I give them a template. Of the things that they should be posting every week hallelujah or every day and they post those things uh, on a daily basis and reply your messages so the facebook would have five administrators hallelujah administrating it because we get more than a thousand messages a day so imagine if i have to be on instagram replying a thousand messages um, a thousand messages on facebook a thousand messages on all on our media platforms so we have people who help us. So when you say, why don't you reply? Uh, that message is personal. I don't reply women because I'm married. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hallelujah. So the number is there. Taina uh, Plomomogan says, you cannot get Papa on this uh, like that true. A true prophet, you just don't reach them. Like that, it's a lie. It's a lie. It's a lie. Hallelujah. I doubt if the man of God sleeps. No. Prophet, when do... Hey, people are, are really concerned. I doubt if the man of God sleeps. Uh, no. There's no time to rest. There's no time to rest. I usually sleep two hours a day. For your own information, yeah. I actually sleep uh, uh, two hours a day. I'm sure you had the prophet at that time saying that the uh, prophet sleeps two hours a day. I sleep from six to eight. During the night, I'm up doing prayers. I'm up doing prayers, intercessions, and praying for people. And then at six o'clock, um, at six o'clock, then I get to sleep. At eight o'clock, then I wake up to start to do my chores and my duties to go to work, business, office. I'm an ambassador. I've got diplomatic issues to be dealing with certain times, uh, government issues. I've got business issues. So that I spend the day doing that. And then I come back home, eat, rest, spend time with my family, play with Eli throw him around, you know, play with a toy car, pretend it's a real car, and prayers start again. And then when prayers start again, before I know it, it is 6 o'clock, and I go to sleep two hours a day. When you really want something, you do it. Hallelujah. So, yes. Uh, 
private one on ones. Let's go, guys. Those ones on private one on one. Love you guys. I'll see you just now. If you have not, you can register on the number that is pinned. I love you so much. God bless you, everybody. Thank you for joining me for the live broadcast of this evening. It was powerful. It was amazing. I've got four hours to do it. So if you want to be part of this group uh, that is going to receive the private one-on-ones, then you have to register. God bless you, everybody. God keep you. And may the end of the Lord be seen over your life. In Jesus' name, shalom.